Hello all, uh, welcome back to my channel, Knowledge Base. Uh, today uh, we shall uh, discuss on the design of if-else logic in uh, Simulink. So for this, uh, we need a, uh, yeah, I uh, will take a constant uh, block, we'll add a constant block and uh, we'll also need a switch block, switch block, yeah, uh, we can directly take it from here. So if you just double click and if you just type switch, you get yeah switch simulink. You need this block as well. Uh, yes, and uh, you need a display block to display the output. Okay. Now uh, yeah, we'll just duplicate this constant block. Yes. So we have three constant blocks. So we'll just connect the input to this. So if ever the input is uh, greater than zero, we need to send this as the output that is uh, one. If ever the input is less than zero, then we'll send two as the output. Yeah. So this is simple if else logic. Yeah, we'll just connect it. So uh, it's very simple. Uh, if you double click on the switch block, you have the threshold value here. And also what is the passing criteria? Uh, U2 greater than or equal to threshold, greater than threshold or uh, U2 is not equal to zero uh, uh, is the you know criteria for passing the first input and the threshold value you can provide. So I have given it as uh, zero as the whatever was there as default so now the input if one is greater than zero if if one is greater than zero which is true that then one uh, the the first uh, you know the top one will be passed so one will be the output if ever the input whichever is coming right if ever it is less than zero then two will be passed as the output so we'll just run this simple logic. Uh, one is the uh, we are getting one as the output similarly if we just change this uh, say for example we'll change this to uh, uh, yeah we'll change this to minus one yeah we'll change this to minus one apply okay and we'll run this now we should get two as the output yes so this was regarding a simple uh, if else logic uh, in the next video, we'll take a real-time uh, uh, vehicle example and you know try to uh, uh, build the if-else uh, logic from there, uh, from the vehicle uh, uh, you know real-time uh, inputs. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, thanks for watching the video. If you like this video, uh, I request you to hit on the thumbs uh, thumbs up button. Yeah. Thank you.